starting on PS2. Let's go. All right, on Stadium 2, starting with Squirtle. <laughs> Little Turtle just racking up this tiny bit of damage. Squirtle, of course, being an amazing rushdown character, having good frame data. Damage output, exactly not the best. But honestly, with your two teammates being Ivysaur and Charizard, you don't need that damage. Right now, though, Apostle seems to be having issues just getting in in general, it seems. He just gets all these single hits and then loses neutral, getting grabbed right now. Here comes the Ivysaur switch. Oh, just straight okay. to Charizard, okay. All right. That's an interesting choice. I thought he would right, just... Arsene on deck. Probably out in a second here. Yeah, there, there he is. is. Here's the big boy. Almost. Whoa! That was DI. That was 100. That was, no, that was not Joker back there. Was that? That was DI. There's... And I think he air dodged. Like, isn't he it... may have been the air dodge, yeah, because that was, he should not have died from that. Yeah. Like, it... jo Joker back air is strong, but it's not that strong. No, no. Oh, no. Oh, okay, okay. He's still alive. Oh, he's, he's, he's alive. He's alive. He's alive. Okay, okay. There we go. Whew. See, that was Brawl. He would have been dead. <laughs> All right, the up B out of shield. Ooh. Wow. Killed at 90. That's pretty impressive, honestly. It was on the platform, but geez. And Joker ain't that light. He is Marthwaite. All right. Just seeing the water gun and then seeing the fly away. It's just so silly, the interaction. <laughs> All right, he burned his jump. He had to switch characters. All right, making back with Charizard. Still in a decent spot. I mean, still a Charizard, bit of a deficit. I mean, he seems to be working the best right now. I would say switch to Ivysaur, but this is working the best right now. So yeah, for him? I'm not going to question it. But right? Arsene is out. The, yeah, you got to go with whatever's working best in the match. Mm -hmm. Go with the flow. Yes. Now, Arsene is up, so... It may not actually be a bad idea, you know, Charizard regardless right now. Can't he do, like, uh, some sort of throw into Flare Blitz and it would kill at this point? Uh, yeah, but it's like a DI trap, I'm pretty sure. Like, it's not true. Mm. I, don't quote me again, I'm not a Charizard player. Ooh, the up air, though. That's gonna take it. Alright, our son's gone. Yeah, bears. Yeah, Alright, you got called. Alright. Alright. See you later, Matt. Right, I'm going to jump off for now, guys. I call my next Losers match. Bloody Knight will take over from now. Yep. See I'll you later. be around for a bit, all right? And good luck, all right? All right thanks. All right. Jerry with a nice stock lead. And I feel like Apostle should be switching out of Squirtle. He wants to get the kill as soon as he can. Because remember, Arsene still builds, even if he doesn't get hit or gets damaged. It's just building up over time. All right, Arsene is out. Ooh, the nair. Not enough. Oh, man, I thought he was going to go for something else with the, the Ivysaur there. I thought he was going to just go for the offstage dare. Probably would have died, but still, it would look really nice. All right, shooting the A-ha. All these spot dodges. Ooh, the, the flare blitz on the stage. He didn't get punished for it. Our set is gone. All right, switching back to Squirtle. That, I mean... Apostle knows his character bet more than I do, but I do wonder why he's going to Squirtle now of all characters. Ooh, Ivysaur. Oh my god, they did not grab. Switch back to Charizard. He just ran up and did a uh, forward tilt. Unfortunately, he's so close to the shield that he got punished with a grab. Ooh, that's the dash attack. Alright, that's his extra jump right there. Yeah, already a quarter of the meter bill for our sin. I don't think we're going to see another in this stock unless somehow Apostle doesn't get stock, like, in this stock right now. Ooh, armor through the guns. Oh, I thought he was going to go for the grab right there, which he did. He did the jab into pivot grab. Oh, the back throw with Ivysaur is going to take the stock right now at 120%. Switching out to Charizard. Oh. Back to Squirtle now. Okay, waterfall up on stage. Now switching to Ivysaur. 
actually. There we go. That's it. Yeah, right now, Pop having issue. Gig off the ledge. The ledge re-grab, though. Going to be punished with a down smash. I unfortunately was called for a match, so I am going to have to hop off the mic. I bid you adieu, for now at least. y'all since the commentators have left to get the streamer in the back on commentary don't leave y'all commentary list possible starting to bring him back at the end of that last game you know starting to rack on a bit of percent get him closer to the uh you know the end of that last stock but jerry still had most mostly an advantage throughout most of the stuff so you see how the different stage works for a possum so far seems to be working pretty well but good jerry doing some work on that platform not getting much out because jerry doesn't get much out of grabs but and just like that, Jerry has been unable to be touched for around 50%. That flame breath finally going to help break the mold. All right, probably going to go into ledge. Interesting decision. Works out for him. Um, but one thing that you worry, you know, when you go all the way to ledge and go past ledge and you grab it, you're losing all of your stage positions. You're losing it all. Um, Those Pokemon trainer does fairly well at ledge, able to get up. Wow, that was a heck of an up smash. Okay, possibly able to recover for now. And now we are back to neutral. Not much lost to possibly getting off that ledge. Oh, that up beam not connecting. Always unfortunate. Back to Squirtle. Trying to break in. Okay. Doesn't die for it. Interesting. Jerry might not know, you know, exactly how long the lag is on that, but definitely could have come up up smash it. I think those side hitbox only last at the beginning of Pokemon Trainer for neutral beam. Granted, you don't you hardly ever see the neutral beam come out, so. Able to recover. It's all about who takes his first stock. We're two minutes in. No stock taken. Very patient gameplay. Hitting the tip of that shield just enough for Jerry to lock in that back here. First stock taken. Two minutes, ten seconds in. <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard Squirtle actually make the sound squirt as he just messes you up off stage. Alright, getting a little bit there, not able to punish that neutral get up. Oh, and he's stuck! Alright, only game forward smash. That's still 27%. I didn't realize that was so much. Golly. Off the top. That always looks so funky. Especially, like, the higher up you go, that the bubble gets smaller. Like, oh, that is, that is weird to look at. All right. Hitting them and recovering. Uh, okay. All right. All right. Cool. All right. Plus was really, he's doing a good job of playing from this ledge, you know, he's, he's on ledge a lot, which would make you think they like, oh no, he's on ledge again, but he, he's not getting too punished for it, and Jerry is going crazy with these guns, it's incredible that that actually didn't connect, he's going pretty far off, not going deep, because that's how good guns are, uh, but he's going off. Alright, Plus comes up to the air. Alright, good gun landing on Jerry's part. And he's, he's done a really good job with these platforms. You know, I think it's the thing that I see a lot of melee players do. Is, um, you know, able to punish people on this platform, be able to get more, be able to get extensions off of it. So very, very cool. Back air, not enough. Treasure's a meaty boy. 
All right, Squirtle back. Oh my god. And now he's fine because he got hit by the gun, so he's able to recover. What in the world? Apostle just stalling at ledge. He's gonna lose that stock, though. Def way past the halfway mark on this game. Apostle right, advantage, not able to steal the stock. I think that definitely would have if that hit. But Jerry doing a good job rolling in, mixing up his recovery, or mixing up his uh, options from ledge. Good landing that guns, getting so much percent off. Of Even 10 per getting 10 percent off of disadvantage is definitely something that I think you might take for granted because like oh it's only 10 percent, but you were in disadvantage, you were losing, and now you're back and your opponent is taking percent for it, and also probably you're in advantage because you got the final hitbox. Guns are such a good move. If Joker had our send there, oh my god, he'd be dead. Right, in a very similar, similar situation to last game. Fossil able to clean up that stock, and now we're a lot closer than it looks. You know, 80 to 0. This is definitely something you can come back from, especially if Fossil's got these combos down. Able to get 46, and now he's in disadvantage, and it keeps going. That was incredible on Apostle's part. That was exactly what, you know, we needed to see more before that in this set. Um, now we're, we're even... But... <laughs> Even the Joker with our send is a little different than just even. All right, good fair game off stage. I think Apostle's rolls are starting to last a little longer. You're not having as much vulnerability on it because it's a much good drag down up smash. Going to take it. That was great. Letting Jerry move on to winner's quarters. The good stuff to him on making that happen.